Yo, 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 coming at you all with a quick reaction. The NBA All-Star starters were just announced on the TNT pregame show. I didn't feel like getting the whole setup going, quite frankly. And what do you know? Just as I predicted, Joel Embiid snubbed from an All-Star starter position. I mean, I thought this was going to happen. And yes, it did. Jason Tatum, Giannis Antetokounmpo, and Kevin Durant round out the front court for the Eastern Conference. Donovan Mitchell and Kyrie Irving will round out the final five starters. Uh, what do you know? Joel Embiid, a guy who has been one of the greatest players this season, who puts up 40 in his sleep nonchalantly, the guy who is taking the center position to the next level in part, you know, doing things, putting it behind his back, turning, stepping, fading from 50 feet away. I mean, having MVP nights every single game, had a tough start to the year. Yes, he missed, what, 11, 12 games, whatever it was. But he has been absolutely bowling out. And this is the same guy that's been snubbed before from the All-Pro teams. The guy that has been snubbed from this and that. Should have won one of the last two MVPs. We know the whole story, right? But now Joel Embiid officially snubbed from an All-Star starter position. He will be a reserve for this game. Now, he's probably going to end up starting uh, as the first reserve because Kevin Durant most likely will not be back. But if he is, uh, Joel will be coming off the bench. And I mean, this just goes for the, the common theme, right? I mean, everybody hates Philly. Yes, uh, Tatum, Giannis, Katie were deserving. But let's be honest, Joel has been one of the greatest players this year. And he's one of the greatest players in the game. And it's a complete atrocity that that man is not starting in the All-Star game it, everybody has a vendetta against Philadelphia. I'm not going to just sit here, uh, and, you know, and say it's Joel. Joel, it's just Philly in general. It's Philly in general. It's disgusting. It's annoying. Take the damn posi uh, position thing out of the All Star voting, okay? Get the best five players in the game. Why not? Why not? I mean, who cares? The game stinks. Any like, it's just a, a fun, you know, type of high environment, uh, high energy type of thing. Yeah, they play for more now. They have the charity. That's great. Great cause. It's awesome. But at the end of the day, who's actually going out there trying their ass off, you know, and, and risking an injury, right? These guys are having fun. They're pulling threes all over the floor. Put the best five guys in the game. Uh, but once again, another Philly athlete snubbed. Of course, it's Joel Embiid. He gets snubbed every single time. They hate him. They hate the process. They hate everything. And uh, it's unfortunate. But Joel Embiid will still show up nonetheless. I know he'll have a great time. And uh, yeah, man, justice for Joel. Get him to start in the damn All-Star game. This is re really Joel. Joel's not starting in the All-Star game. That is a joke. And James Harden's not starting either. Like I said, Mitchell and uh, Kyrie, which again, both deserving. But now the Sixers, who have been one of the hottest teams in the league, 19-4 uh, and four in their last 23 games. The Sixers are the hottest team in the league, and they don't have one player starting in the All-Star game. That is an absolute joke. It must be fixed.